Hello everyone. In this video, we'll discuss about what is the difference between bar and dynamic in C sharp. This is one of the interview questions uh, asked in interviews. What is bar? Bar is basically a type of the variable that is declared and the compiler decides at the compile time. The type of the variables, the data type of the variable is decided at compile time. What is defined at the initialization time? That data type is taken by the compiler. Let's consider we are writing bar x is equal to text uh, as the data type. So it will consider as string, as test. So errors are caught at compile time since compiler compile it in case of a bar. But in case of dynamic, the type of the variable is declared uh, is decided at the runtime. Hello everyone. In this video, we'll discuss about what is the difference between bar and dynamic in C sharp. Bar. Bar is basically the type of the variable that is declared and decided at the compile time. So when we declare any variable with bar, the initialization of the variable need to be there. So bar x is equal to test. So within this test as a string, so it will be uh, defined as x as a, as a string data type as the bar. In case of dynamic, the dynamic, the type of the variable is declared and decided at the runtime. No need to initialize at the time of declarations. We can put a dynamic x, x is equal to 10 or x equal to string x test uh, in dynamic. So errors caught at the compile time since in case of bar it is at compile time. So errors will be caught at the compile time but in case of dynamic errors are not caught at compile time rather the errors will be caught at the runtime. Once the bar is declared any certain data type you cannot change it later. For example, bar x, x equal to 10. That means x is equal to 10 of data type int is defined in the x. So if we wanted to change it x is equal to test in the next line, the compiler will throw error because the compiler has already decided that x is of type integer. Now after assigning to a string is not possible. But in case of dynamic, so once the dynamic variable is declared, you can reassign to some other data type because it's a runtime declaration. So dynamic x is equal to 10, if x is equal to test, or any of the property which is defined for the data type, if that is not there or if, PJ, if there is a chance of error, it will be caught at the uh, runtime. So the compiler will for this uh, declarations dynamic x is equal to 10 and x is equal to test it will not give an uh, error as compiler requires the type of the string but remember if any properties or any of the things which is uh, which will throw error or exceptions that will not caught at compiler time it will be caught at the runtime so in the interview you will be asked let's say we are writing bar x is equal to 10 at the next line x is equal to test the interviewer will ask you what it will show, whether it will execute or it will give you error. This kind of scenario questions will be asked in the interviews. Thanks for watching.